When it comes to Lake Mead's water levels, even the biggest storms that hit Las Vegas aren't much of a factor. The Las Vegas Valley saw a deluge of water from a series of monsoonal storms that moved in Friday and that dumped more than an inch of rain in a matter of days. While it seems like such a torrent of water would provide a substantial boost to Lake Mead, that just isn't the case. Even massive storms like those that hit over Labor Day weekend only contribute what amounts to a fraction of an inch of increased water levels at Lake Mead, said Paul Miller, a hydrologist with the National Weather Service's Colorado Basin River Forecast Center in Salt Lake City. After years of mostly seeing its water levels fall, Lake Mead has steadily risen since April. The surface of the 247-square-mile reservoir, which provides about 90% of southern Nevada's water, currently sits at 1,066.2 feet above sea level, about 20 feet higher than where the lake's surface sat at the end of March. But that's in large part due to federal regulators releasing substantially more water from Lake Powell's Glen Canyon Dam downstream to Lake Mead a move made possible by an extremely wet winter that sent far above average snow melt into the river and its tributaries. The general rule of thumb on the river is that one foot of water at Lake Mead equates to roughly 100,000 acre feet. An acre foot is a measurement of the amount of water needed to cover an acre in a foot of water, and is generally enough water to supply two to three homes for a year.